Hi, this is the Hairy Animal and this is my guide to making felt roofing shingles. Ready-made felt shingles are a stylish way of covering a gazebo or summer house roof, but they're quite expensive. This is how I made my own, quite a lot cheaper than they can be bought ready-made. Apologies for the video which sometimes goes out of focus. I shan't leave the continuous autofocus on another time. I started off with 8 meter by 1 meter rolls of torch-on roofing felt from an eBay supplier in Milton Keynes. These rolls had minor defects so were somewhat cheaper than normal but still perfectly adequate. Having decided on the style of tile I was going to make, I made a template from hardboard and calculated that to get a sufficient overlap between strips I'd get two out of a 19 inch strip. So the first job was to cut lots of 19 inch strips. It's not easy to cut, I tried big scissors and a sharp knife and both were hard work but I succeeded eventually. Here's my template laid on a 19 inch strip. I started off using chalk to mark it with but found later that the edge of a screwdriver blade was much better. Once cut the two strips are essentially ready to lay depending on the width of the roof. It doesn't matter if you go a bit too far when cutting because any small cuts will get sealed when the felt is stuck down. The strips are alternated to get a tiled effect and then attached to the roof by gently heating with a blowtorch which burns off the protective plastic layer then melts the tarry backing. This then sticks really well to the roof and previous layers of felt shingles as you work up the roof from the bottom to the top. In the corners I made sure there was a bit of overlap and it all seems very weatherproof. And that's basically it. If I was doing it again I'd make sure the end joins were diagonal as the vertical joins don't look right but otherwise I'm very pleased with the results and it cost about a quarter of the price of ready-made shingles.